Hey guys, welcome back to Jersey Shore Beers and Brews Reviews. Friday night, we got some beers in the fridge. We're gonna start tipping them down, baby. Get some reviews up there. Um, new beers that I haven't seen, uh, I picked up the other day. Uh, we just reviewed our first, that one was from Lebanon. And uh, I figured I'd uh, dust another one off that's uh, from directly from Germany to kind of make up for it. It's Reisdorf Kolsch. Um, can't really read much of it because it's mostly in German except for the date, which seems to be 1516. Um, the warning on the back is in American English. Uh, I don't see anything else on it. Oh. Ingredients, water, barley malt, hops. Keep well refrigerated and store in clean, food safe conditions. Product of Germany. Brewed and canned by Private Browell, Heinrich Rustoff, GmbH and Company. Cologne, Germany, imported by United International Incorporated, Oxford, Connecticut. So we got a one pint, nine ounces, or one point, yeah, one pint, point nine ounce fluid ounces. I don't have an alcohol number on it. I would think it's somewhere around between five and six. Could be a little bit less than that. But man, I'm excited. I haven't had a culture in a while. Cultures are uh, fun, not, not even fun. They're tasty, man. Nice old head developing on that thing. Look at how light that is, too. Crystal clear. Nothing else on there. That's a shame. I wish I could read more of it. I should get a translator thing for my phone. This way I can translate it. Big old creamy head on there. Oh, German spiciness there. Now the difference between the Kolsch and the, the lager and the Pilsner is just a little bit in the yeast taste. Um, I kind of I kind of remember Kolsch as being a little bit better than the others. Um, I guess I'm gonna find out here shortly. But it's been a couple years since I had a Kolsch. They're very difficult to come by. Not a lot of people brewing them. And again, you know, I wish more people were brewing something than just an IPA and you know, you know what I'm saying. So uh, let's see what it does. It smells wonderful. Man, that is clean. That is really clean. A little bit sweeter. Got the hops there. I think it lasts all of about 0.1 seconds in your mouth. I mean, it's still wet. It's not. It's not a dry. Um, hmm. Hmm. Very good. Very good. Um. Wow. I don't have anything to compare it to. Um. I might have another culture in there I might have seen and grabbed. We'll see, I guess. But uh, this one, uh, I don't know if you like good German beers. I would definitely get this one. The place I bought this from, you know, I, I did a review of the 120 minute IPA, Dogfish Head, and it's, it's coming up with this group of things. But I was a little disappointed because, I don't know, the Dogfish Head was only two years old. Um, the longer that you keep them things around, the better that they end up tasting. Um, it didn't score as high as I was hoping. I was really hoping to have a legendary on the site, but it didn't make it. It didn't make it. Um, this is nowhere near a legendary, but it is a very good beer. Um, for a number, mm. Mm. florals, a little woody, spicy. Very good. Um, do I think it's an eight? No. Do I think it's high sevens? Yeah. So now I'm torn between like, you know, seven five is like your basic middle of the road. Just a damn good beer. You know, and then you start ticking up the scale to the eights or down the scale towards the sixes. You know, this one, you know, this, not this one, but, you know, this one barely made the sevens, but that's not the case with this one. 
This one I'm going to put in at like, uh, hmm, 7, 9, 7, 9. It's, it's bordering on greatness, and if there was just a little bit more taste to it, I think, you know, I would probably bring it in the 8s, but it's just a damn good beer. Um, if you like Germans, look out for it. All right, guys, Friday night, be safe out there. If you're drinking, don't drive. If you're driving, don't drink. Call Uber to get you home safe. Be able to do it again tomorrow. All right? Peace, guys. We'll catch up to you.